What's up everyone? I'm Fearless Falcon and whoa, okay, that's the wrong thing. There we go. Uh, <laughs> great start to the show, right? Uh, and welcome back to Pokemon! Where is my... here it is. Click. Click. We're going Gligar hunting! Because I still have not gotten the shiny Gligar that I want, and we are going to get that today. I don't care how long it takes. Okay, maybe I do care how long it takes. It might take hours. I only really budgeted like an hour or two for this. But you know... We vibin'. Diglett. Wow, really? We we have one Diglett point. Okay, that's... That's fantastic. That's fine, though. I did not come down here to... We're, we're, we're trying something... Ooh! We're trying something a little different this time. We're not even gonna bother trying to go for Diglett points. We're gonna leave that to all the other people that are on the underground zone. Put that back in the box and bury it. <laughs> uh, we are exclusively going to just try and go for Gligars. Any Gligar we see, we're just gonna run straight into it and that's gonna be it. Like this one. Not shiny. You're gonna be like, no more Gligars? Okay, next. This is honestly going to be a little faster. There's two Gligars right here. They're both full odds. Neither is shiny, but that's fine. Because I'm getting that Gligar. I have confidence that today is the day. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe we'll get that Gligar. Maybe this one? Are you blue? Bucket of blue paint? No. Okay, then. Okie doke. That's, 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 that's fine. That's perfectly fine. I don't mind that at all. That's perfectly fine. You just keep being there, not being sparkly. Come back when you have paint on you. Please? That's a cacturn. Ah, uh, okay. You know, for the longest time, when I first, like, encountered cacturn, I, I thought that, like, the front flap of his little hat there was, like, his nose. Don't know why. That's a Cacnea. Ooh, there's a thing right here. I'll take that. Four confirmed in the wall. All right. What else is in here? What else is in here? Give me something good. Green sphere. Where where is everything else? Oh, it's a hard stone. Okay, well, whatever. I still got loot. I still got two things. I really wish I could trade these statues in for something. Ooh, 
made all these statues anyway? Like, what ancient civilization made statues and buried them? Not that I really mind one way or the other. I'm sure that some ancient civilization would be able to figure it out on their own. This is very detailed statues. Hi, Tauros! <sighs> I am contractually obligated to whoop the ass! Of every Tauros I encounter, or at least try to. So, uh, throw hands. Hooves. Throw hooves! And Tauros just, like, takes his hoof off and throws it at me. That'd be stupid. Roleplay! Sure, let's learn roleplay. What does roleplay do? Copies the target's ability. I mean, it's better than teleport, I guess. Learn learn how to roleplay or something, I don't know. The adventure continues. My leg won't stop bouncing. Why won't my leg stop bouncing? Can my leg stop bouncing for five seconds? Don't see any Gligars. Hi, my Brava. I will deviate slightly from the path to encounter you. Simply for the sake of why not. Which is another Pokemon. I don't think I've seen a why not in here. Like, anywhere. Hi, Larion. That Cacnea is not giving up. Yep. Yep. Keep 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 coming, dude. You're gonna get me eventually. I am I am so ri ah, okay. Mama Cacturn decided to say hi. <laughs> okay, that was awesome. Oh daddy cacturn, sorry. You are still trying, huh? I'm over here taking down notes to tell me uh, when to look for things to put in the highlight reel and you're just sitting over there like, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get He He is really trying. I shall humor you. In fact, you have been so dedicated, little Cacnea that I shall grant you the honor, assuming we have not caught a Cacnea yet, of being our Cacnea. You put in the effort, you you worked those hours, welcome to the team. Welcome aboard. You're hired. For the sake of collecting for the Pokédex, I guess. By storing water in its body, this desert dweller can survive for 30 days without water. That's neat. That's very neat. Perfect for when you want to just, you know, vibe for 30 days. You just want to stay in your house for 30 days and don't do anything. Apparently the correct answer is be a cacnea. Now what's in the wall here? Four! Okay. Ooh, a 
Sunstone, I think. Yep. And then maybe over here? Maybe over here? Maybe over... At least let me know where it was. Uh, okay. Well, whatever. No big deal. I got stuff. I got loot. I got a bug box. Can I get a refund on my loot box, please? This sucks. Hello? Management? Hello? Why is... Why does my jaw hurt today? Did I, like, have my mouth clenched over the night or something? Just sleep and be like... Nah, 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 nah. Noticing a distinct lack of Gligars. This is rather disappointing. I... Oh, there's a Gligar! Hello! Do you think the little kids in the Pokemon world use Gligars like kites? Do you think that kites were designed based off of Gligars? You could probably use a... You could probably make a Gligar kite. That'd be cool. Aha! This is the one! This isn't the one! That's fine! So many Vibravas! I mean, I know they're like ground flying or whatever. I think they're ground flying. Is Vibrava ground flying? Or is it ground dragon already? I don't remember. Let me Google that real quick. Vibrava. Vibrava. is already ground dragon type. Okay, so why aren't we getting any Gligars? That would be weird though. Like, it would be really weird for a Pokemon to gain a type on evolution and then immediately change the type on evolution. Like, I can't really think of many Pokemon that, that change a primary typing completely. I mean, like, it'd be one thing to go kind of similar, like, oh, this was, uh, rock flying, now it's ground flying. I don't know. But, like, it'd be a completely different thing to evolve straight from, like, steel type to ice type. You need some sort of middleman there. That would actually be really interesting, like, uh... A temperature-themed Pokemon, kind of, that, that, like, starts, like, d depending on which version you have, it starts as either ice or fire type as its earliest evolution, and then as it evolves, it becomes ice-fire, and then when it's fully evolved, it's the opposite type of, of what it was to begin with, and also out. So, like, if you're in red version, you start with a fire type, it becomes fire ice, and then ends as ice type. But if you're in blue version, it starts as ice, goes to fire ice, and then becomes fire type or something. I don't know. I'm just thinking aloud here, seeing what sounds cool, seeing what sounds not cool. Not seeing much activity right now. I did set up my secret base to be like... 
flying friendly, right? Right? Pretty sure. Alright, well, no big deal. We'll just keep going. I'll just mine this stuff up first for a change of pace. Nothing like a quick little change of... Oh, what is that? Oh, that's a heat rock. Nothing beats a quick little change of pace every now and again. Hello, I see that. Man, a lot of red in that wall, huh? I miss being able to bury spears and have little trick traps and playing capture the flag with my friend in his secret base, but oh well. The new underground isn't bad. I'd say it's a downgrade, but I wouldn't say it's like terrible. I see that. That was really hidden. Diglett! Yeah. Seasonal allergies be like. No sign of any Gligars, moving on. Alright, that's it. I'm going back to my secret base and checking to make sure that I'm actually being flying type friendly at the moment because I am not seeing any Gligars! Wait, I can just check the map. What am I doing? I can just check the map. Why aren't I just checking the map? I'm being a moron. I should be checking the map. Yeah, flying type up, up, up. So what's the deal? Why, why... Why am I not getting... Okay. <sighs> Can we close the map, please? Thank you. Maybe it's just because it's a small room. Maybe I need to go to the big room. Maybe I'm just unlucky. Who knows? Let's try going over to the big room. Diglett. Down here, there is usually... A Diglett. Nope. Doesn't look like it. Alright. But there is something in the wall here. everything. I'm not... Okay. Well, that was an utter disaster. I didn't get anything out of that. Oh, well. Is there a diglet over here? Nope. How about over here? Yep. Diglet. That's a scyther. Ooh. Hello. I mean, I already have a Scyther. I was just really checking to see if it was shiny on the off chance it was. 
Because, you know, if it was shiny, then we'd have a huge reaction on our hands. Huge! And somehow saying that, ooh, made my ear vibrate in a really weird way. Ooh, that was uncomfortable. Huge! Okay, yeah, that frequency. That frequency right there. My, my, my right ear does not like that frequency. Ooh. Ugh. Feels so weird. It's like, like vibrating really fast in there, and I don't like it. But at the same time, it's one of those like keep doing it so that you better understand the feeling and sensation in Hello Gligar. I have a monkey. Is there a Diglett out here? No. But at least there's oxygen. Right on, Cacturn. Scorupy. Scorupy would be a nice shiny to have. Are you shiny? Make my day. Make my day. Zack has returned to the surface. I don't know who that was or what they were doing down here in the Grand Underground, but I'm glad they returned to the surface and seemed to be having a good day. Speaking of people having a good day, I hope you guys are having a good day. It has been a bit of a week. A bit of a crazy week. But everything seems to be going fine on my end. <sighs> Aside from me being really, really tired. Must have been the pizza I had earlier, I don't know. I had like four slices of pizza for dinner, so I am like digesting that right now. Out of the way, Cacturn. I'm digesting that and like I'm just kind of sleepy because of it. Maybe I should eat after I stream. Why am I leaving, like, footprints as though I'm jumping? Like, look, look at my character's footprints. It's like he's jumping. Like a bunny hop. Hi, Gligar. You wanna play? Are you shiny? No, you're not. Next! No diglets, huh? Well, I'll at least get this. Who knows? Maybe we'll get something really good. Or we can get a stupid box. I can already max out dark. Oh, a rare bone! That took up a lot of space. Jeez. It's a long bone. Must be a femur. That's an Absol. Absol is a very well-designed Pokemon. Alright, how about in here? Anything special in here going on? Uh, yeah, this, 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 this is not good. Fight me, Golbat. Sp 
Spinning fire kick. Wow, you actually survived that. Okay. Maybe if we, like, swap servers? Discontinue to vibe. Successfully downloaded update data for what even is that? What what was that game? I only saw the icon, so I couldn't tell what it was. It might have been Sky, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. Okay, let's try this internet stuff again. Here we go! Get ready. And begin! And they're off! To a roaring start. A gen genuinely... Okay, yeah, there we go. Hello. You wanna go mining with me? I don't know, I guess they didn't want to go mining with me. Ooh! Oh, I missed. So where's the loot? No sign of the loot. Okay, that's fine. That is perfectly fine. I got two things. Congratulations! You got two things and Liss Heart has entered the Grand Underground. Two things in the wall. Will we get them before the whole thing fall? Why did I swap? When did I swap? Did I say you could swap? Did I give you permission to swap? Okay, so we know where one thing is, at least. Oh. Well, that was relatively simple. A Duskin Ore statue! Yes, I know I just pronounced it wrong. Shut. Shut. Shut your faces. Wow, I really drilled straight in there, huh? Okay. things. Them spheres. I'm not interested in your bronze ores. Or your cacneas. I want a Gligar. Specifically a shiny sparkly blue one. If possible. Like, I'm not, I'm not trying to pressure you or anything, game, but, like, if you could get me a shiny Gligar, that'd be really, really awesome, and I'd be really appreciative. I mean, I'm getting Legends of Arceus anyway, but, like, you know, maybe, maybe give me some incentive? out in 
five days. Legends of Arceus comes out in five freaking days, I think. Doesn't it come out on the 20th? Remind me again, when does that come out? I think it's the 20th. Does anyone, uh... Anyone know? It's like, correct me if I'm wrong, but I am fairly certain that that game comes out on the 20th, and I am very much looking forward to playing that game. Ooh, green orb! Well, no way I'm getting that. Too reckless. But here's the thing, I don't really care. I go fast, but it's not like there's a limit on how many things I can dig up. So yeah, I miss some stuff, but I also get like a net gain of more than someone who meticulously, like, digs out every single thing. It's a box. It's a box with a disproportionately large statue inside it. It's a diglet! Alright, what do we got here? Four confirmed in the wall, so that pretty much means go nuts. And hope you find something. I didn't need a box anyway. We're getting really close to the Diglett boost, though. That's nice. I was just sort of meandering over to the to the Gligar room at a leisurely pace, and I didn't even realize that we were getting close. stretch. I'll be the first to stand up and admit that I'm not very high energy today, and that's perfectly fine. Some days you're just like, you know what? I'm a vibe today. Today is a vibe day. Vibe check on Gligar. Gl Gligar, vibe check. Hug me. Do something. Gligars! There's two of them! Three in the room at once, that is... I mean, it's not decent shiny odds, but it's still good to see more Gligars showing up! That is making me happy. That, make a, that makes me a happy falcon. I am a happy bird! And we are really, 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 really cl Oh, wait, you can't see the, uh... There you go. We are, we are two diglets away from the diglet boost. 
So I need to like zip out and see if I can find one. Or something. Diglett! Okay, next Diglett we find is a guaranteed Diglett boost. Just do a quick scout of the room just in case there's a Gligar lying around in wait somewhere. I don't see one. And everyone needs to listen for that loud whistle that says we're starting the fun. Here comes the shinies. There we go! Starting my timer, because I always keep a 3 minute and 40 second timer so I know when to get into the room. That's a scyther, hello. It's time for the good shit. Like, this is the part where we just scout the room, and if we don't see a Gligar, we leave. And we go right back in. We scout the room again, and if we don't see a Gligar, we leave. There's a Gligar over there, so I need to, I need to fight it. Fight me! You will be shiny! I command you! Ah, oh. But I commanded you... Onyx, I'm not getting involved with you right now. You, you do your own thing. Ferret, I'm not getting involved with you right now. You do your own thing. Enjoy your walk. Well, there's a Scyther at least! A perfectly standard, non-special, green Scyther with nothing going for him. People wonder why I don't care. Ugh, this whole expedition is a total mess. I'm not getting anything. I've barely even seen a Gligar. Hello, Pupitar. Yeah. I'll admit, Titar's a really good Pokemon. But I think I have one lying around somewhere. Gligar! Yes! Oh. It's like, yes, no. has been so goddamn dry lately. I just had a consistent, like, cough and just feeling kind of crappy.
Alright, the timer should be ending right about now. Right about now. Right about- Ooh, hi Gligar. There we go, that's the end of the timer. So, everything in the room currently still has double shiny chance, so I will fight everything in the room right now. Might as well, right? I'm not gonna let an increased shiny chance go to waste. Even if, admittedly, I don't really care for Shiny Cacturn. Or Cacturn in general. Or really many grass types. I usually end up gravitating towards Dragon, Fairy, and Ghost. Which are, ironically, all things you don't want to mess with for various reasons. You don't want to mess with the fa with the fair folk, because they'll, you know, mess you up. You don't want to mess with dragons, because they'll mess you up. And you don't want to mess with ghosts, because they'll mess you up. It's just that their method of messing with you is completely different depending on species. God, I've tangled myself. That was supposed to be a humorous jape, and I have tangled myself. Oh, okay. Gligar, help me! Whoa. I went back to my mouse on instinct. Alright, who else is over here? Not interested. Thank you. Thank you very much for calling, sir, but we're not interested in your resume right now. If you have any complaints, please fill out a form and put it in the uh, paper shredder and we will get back to you never. Someone will handle it eventually, I'm sure. It's a Cacnea! It's a Scyther! Scyther looks like he's wearing, like, the same kind of boots that Pokemaniac characters in, like, Gen 4 wear. Or Gen 3. Like, it doesn't look like actual legs. It looks like, like, stick legs that have, like, feet glued onto them. El Buto Gigante. Anyone else? Oh, there's still more. It's a Rhyhorn. Doesn't do much. It's Cacnea. Again, doesn't do much. That's everything. 
Well, it wouldn't be an episode of Diamond and Pearl if I didn't go shiny hunting for the thing that Nate keeps requesting I shiny hunt for. So we're gonna zip over to Hearth Home. And I guess we'll go looking for a radar round of Cricketoon. Wouldn't it be funny? Because I don't think Nate is here today. Wouldn't it be funny if we actually found it? Like, he's been asking us to get one for, like, weeks. And we found it and he wasn't here. That'd be simultaneously, like, sad, but also hilarious. So, clearly, for the sake of irony, we have to get one today, right? Like it's, like, it's not even, like, a, a discussion of, like, odds or anything. It's, like, the universe is going to bend to allow us to do this simply for the sake of, hey, wouldn't it be weird if... So who are we fighting? That is a Starly! my dear. That is a Starly. No, no, wait, wait, main console. Sorry, sorry. It's the magical moving falcon. Okay, this one looks like it's furthest away without risking us getting into a different encounter. Hello! It begins! If you're watching, amigo, this one's for you! Kick him! Spin kick! A lot of spoink have been spotted on Route 214. Okay. That's great, but uh, at the same time, who cares? Spoink, or, spoink lead a very sad existence. TBH. And I feel very bad for them. Okay, so there's one over here, so that means... That's good! <coughs> uh, sorry. This looks like the furthest, so going with that. Systematically obliterating every cricket tune in the in the neighborhood. Just to find a yellow one. But that's fine, I can do this. I can do this all day. Night. Like ow! headphones yanked a strand of hair out of my head that did not feel good why do you do this to me why do you, why do you do this to me why do you do this to me headphones why do you do this to me 
I ask so little of you that you just provide music and don't yank my hair out. And you consistently fail to provide on one of those two things. Moving on. You lose. Okay, this looks like the furthest spot, so dive in. Honestly, like, enjoy shiny hunting with Pokey Radar. Like, there's a huge difference between just like hatching eggs endlessly and endlessly and praying to God that you get the egg you want and Pokey Radar. Like, Pokey Radar is fun. The highs and lows of seeing your chain continue or break and hoping that you see that precious sparkly patch of grass. my heart racing just thinking about it. That or I'm having a heart attack. Let's hope it's the former and not the latter. This looks like the furthest spot. Here we go. My, my imagination is that, like, when I when I tell her to do that, Zhao Lin, like, does, like, a spinning sonic roll forward, just, like, tuck and rolls, and rolls, and, like, sticks its foot out and just slams it into them as it, as it breaks the spin. So you just, all of a sudden, you just have this foot just coming out of you, and just like, wham! I have an overactive imagination. I do not have a chain anymore. We will, though. What are we fighting? Uh. Hi, Roselia. Pleasure to see you. I'm sure you smell very nice. Okay, this one looks like the furthest away, so we're gonna go with that. Even worse! Even worse! It's a Badu. Even... Even worse, somehow. I asked so little. It's a vent that exchanges air from the Grand Underground. Probably also how Pokemon get in, I don't know. How do you think the big Pokemon got into the Grand Underground? Do you think they're stuck down there? Like, do you think, like, the Rhydon is just stuck in the Grand Underground? Do you think it, like, grew up in the... Do you think it wants to leave? I know that there are like some cave axolotl species that have grown up in complete darkness and never want to leave because they don't know what the sun looks like and they don't even have eyes when they grow up. That's what I get for not using a repel. Bop! 
パーダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダダ Stop killing this cricket tune. That's that's priority UNO right now. Kick him! Tuck and roll! Really? Nothing? Nothing? All that work and nothing? Okay, this one looks really far away from us, so we'll just do this. That wasn't even a radar chain. Uh, we're loading. Well, maybe it was the radar. I doubt it was the radar chain, but let's pretend it was, just for the sake of maybe it was. Punch. Punch. Just a top speed punch. Super Ultra High Speed Mega Ultra Punch of Doom! And also Knuckles. Slash Fish. Alright, what are we fighting? looks the furthest away, so we're gonna jump right into this. You're making me grind my teeth here! Like, here I am trying my absolute best to get a shiny for one of my friends who has insisted for weeks now to get this specific sh- Ooh, hidden ability! Hello! What is Staraptor's hidden ability? Hold on. Reckless. Oh, I don't like Reckless. Reckless bad. I mean, it's good, but at the same time, it's not good. It, it really depends on, like, what Pokemon you're playing and what playstyle you're using. If you're really going in all in on that, uh, do or die attitude, then yeah. Yeah, Reckless is good, and I didn't even walk into a shaking patch of grass. Would've been really funny if that had been shiny, but it's not, because of course not. Alright, that one looks like the furthest away, so we're gonna go right into that. March. It's a Staravia.
I can keep doing this. I don't care how long it takes. Like, we've only been live for an hour. You know how much more time I got? About an hour. Fight me. That is a buddy. That makes me sad. Oh, before I could even move. I didn't even have time to pull out the radar. There was just a buddy that I stepped on and it jumped at me. Sorry! Really didn't mean to do that, I swear. Ooh, hidden ability! What is Roselia's hidden ability? Well, Roserade, I suppose. Roserade Pokemon. Technician. You're a powerful Pokemon, right? I mean, you're a third stage Evo. Uh, Roserade is a third stage Evo. Fairly high special attack. I mean, the champion uses it. It could be a valid, valid thing to use. You get any multi-hit moves? You get Magical Leaf. That would be boosted by Technician. Like everyone, hold up! I'm 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 researching. Catch it! If nothing else, it's hidden ability. If absolutely nothing else, it's hidden ability. We'll keep the chain going until it breaks now. Like, we're already in on this for the whole ride, right? Like, we might as well see this through to the end. However close or far it may be. As I stretch my leg. That was the end of it. I guess it was closer than I thought. You know, if that's supposed to be Cricketune's nose, and he's got the mustache, then the mustache should be like above his nose. That That's wrong. It should be below the nose. But then again, it's a bug, so it's not a mustache. It's probably like a sensory organ of some kind that just looks like a mustache and someone was like, hey, you know what's a good idea? Let's give this guy a mustache. He's supposed to be a conductor. 
Okay, that looks like the furthest one away that's not a threat to walk into. Here we go. Well, it certainly isn't a threat. <laughs> I could stomp that thing. Working with, like, tiny Pokemon like that is, like, the same rule I have with dogs. Like, if a dog is acting aggressive, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be cautious, but I'm not scared of dogs that I could easily, like, you know, punt like a football if I needed to. If I can pick it up in one hand, I'm not really gonna be that scared of it. Except Chihuahuas. They scary. They angry. You ever seen an angry Chihuahua? They 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 think they're like the big dog on the block. They they're like a a Bidoof that thinks they're like Dialga itself. It's like every dog breed has the same level of aggression, but it's like proportional to size, or it's the same regardless of size. So like a big dog, like a Mastiff, has like. 10 aggression points, but it's like, you know, size 100. Whereas a Chihuahua has 10 aggression points, but it's size 1. There's something over here? Hidden item? Nope. Wrong button. Alright, this feels like a safe bet. Square up. Circle down. No. That 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 is the line today. No. No. I am here on request from a friend to find a shiny cricketoon. So shinies are GTFO. <laughs> Fight me. Just slowly turns into the THX logo. God, could you imagine, like, a Pokemon that just had, like, the THX sound as its cry? Like, you just send it into battle, and it's just like, oh no. And, 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 and you, you have to hopelessly stand there and watch as it goes. For, like, ten seconds. Dude, I turned off my volume for that! Bro! Bro, just give me a shiny so this nightmare can be over. God dang, 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 dang. The chain broke. Again. Why does it keep breaking? I ask so nicely. Sleepy. It's a burb. It's a burb. It's a burb. I mean, 
you could always try the capture method. That would be a waste of Pokeballs, but it would certainly up our chances of continuing the chain on Cricketune. You know what? Let's do that. I got 140 Quick Balls. Oh. You want to play like that. Well, okay then. If you're going to play like that and waste my money, then I'll just punch you. Or I'll command my fire monkey to punch you. With his tail. At... While spinning... At Mach 2. Good spot. Bring it on, Cricketoon! Just catch a bunch of Cricketoons, because that's really all I can hope for right now. I said it before and I'll say it again. If they break out of it, I'll kill them. And you can quote me on that, as long as you indicate that I am talking about Pokemon. And not, you know, some fucked up real life thing. the ball. Please. Thank you. I'll, uh, release it later. I like this. I like this a lot. We're powering through. And we're upping our odds of continuing the chain this way. I'll have to release all these guys later individually one by one and that'll take time. But... It shaves time on camera, which is what I need... To do! Speed yeet! We rolling the dice here! Hmm. All right, sure. I trust this patch. 
I feel confident. I feel confident that we can catch this thing. We're like 60 plus levels above it. This one. That's the interesting thing. Even even at base level, we're still essentially running four encounters for the price of run. Of run? <laughs> for the price of run! For the price of one, we're essentially running four encounters here, because each one of the four patches of grass could be shiny. I mean, I once had a shiny patch show up on round two. Like with a chain of two, I caught a shiny metadite in a shiny patch of grass. So anything's possible. The hunt continues! I'm not feeling confident about any of those. So we're gonna do a reset. We're gonna do a reset. We're gonna do a reset right here. This one I feel more confident about. Our chain up to ten. Which means that from now on we have increased shiny odds. This one. the best bet over here hello time with my shout despite being completely asleep. Oh, now you wake up.
Maybe it's not so much sleep given how quickly they wake up and more just like really, really being tired all of a sudden. You know, like a bit of drowsiness. Crap, I just ran into the wrong patch of grass! Well, whatever. If it gets caught, it'll be fine, right? I hope. I really freaking hope. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. You know what? It'll be fine. We'll be fine. The chain will continue and it'll be fine! Told ya! Bum 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 I'm so tired today and I don't know why. I think I just because I haven't drank enough water or something, I don't know. Not eating enough. Either way, I'm just sleepy. A shiny would be a great way to wake up though. So here it is! One totally shiny Cricketune. Can we just like doodle, go into, go in, like screenshot that, go into like Microsoft Paint and just like color it shiny. It did not like that idea. Congratulations, you did a grand total of one freaking damage. Yay for you! Um. I get the feeling I just screwed myself over, but whatever. Alright, this patch. This one. Right there. Trust your gut. I did not trust my gut. I was going to go for the one on the left, but I went for the one on the right. So... Don't mess with me. Please. I'll pay you. I'll pay you $10. I'm pretty sure I have $10 in coins over here. Scattered across the mess that my desk has become. Am I really pleading with a video game? Yep. This is where my life is. This is what my life has become. Just, 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 just one. Just one shiny. One shiny. To appease my friend. None of those are good!
That's doable. This one is doable. This one is this one is a good chance. Don't ask me to go into like the the long-winded description of explaining it because I'm busy just like analyzing the entire situation with my eyes, analyzing, analyzing, analyzing. Crit capture. Analyze this. Throws Pokeball directly at face. Remember, kids, you can always win by just applying Pokeball direct to face. Why can't we catch fainted Pokemon? I mean, I get why, but at the same time, like, I feel like you should be able to. far in now to back out. Don't test my patience, you stupid bug. Hunter, get out of here. Show him what a real bug can do. It, but you really didn't need to crit there. Like, now we're actually reaching the point where... Are you fucking serious? We're actually reaching the point where, like, I actually need to start focusing on dedicating time to catching each Pokemon that we come across, because otherwise I will break the chain and I will be upset because I invested... We're 20 deep now. What the fuck? You're tempting me. You're tempting me. You are begging me to kill you. Guess what? I'm not going to fall for that. You don't have permission to die yet. Your brothers may have, but I will not grant you permission to die. Next Pokemon! Oh, we're loading! painful. The, the other fight we just did was like pulling teeth. That was more like just, you know, vibing. I don't know why I've been saying vibe so much lately. It's just like a word that I kind of latched onto over the last week or so. I don't know why. It's like an earworm, but it's an earworm. Word. Earword. Ear word. Did you really just break out of the Pokeball while I was looking at my phone? To make sure the stream was still running? How dare you? How god fucking dare you? Swap.
Fall swipe! <laughs> Don't follow through. You could go all the way through, but we're not going to follow through. Throw a Dusk Ball. Has a high chance at night. It's night. Pretty sure it's nighttime. Look out the window, I can't see Jack. It's all complete. It's pitch black out there. Aside from the occasional car. Yeah. Big surprise. Big surprise! It's a Crick Tune! You know, might as well just keep going. Where I can... You have the audacity! In my house! Thank you, Shaolin. Um, but you have the audacity to not be caught? How dare you, sir? Or ma'am, I didn't catch what gender you are. How dare you, ma'am? like Scyther's feet there really do look like boots. Like it looks like he's got like normal legs and he's just wearing boots. Crit! And stay down. Right here! Take the risk and slap you across the face and let you f just faint, but I, I'm too deep in this chain. I'm too deep in this shiny radar chain to let you to let you die. So, as much as I absolutely hate that I have to do it, I have to fight you and I have to catch you. As much as I would absolutely love to just throw a quick ball and if you broke out, you're dead. I can't afford that luxury when we're at number 23 in the chain. <laughs> One, two, three, thank you very much. I am quite pleased with that. I mean, I'm just going to release him into the wild later, but eh. This one. Quick ball! Pronto! Go, go, go! You can do it. You can stay in the ball. I believe in you. Thank you. Look, it's pretty simple. Sometimes you just gotta talk to the game. Sometimes you just gotta 
Sweet talk the Pokemon. You just gotta, you gotta like hold the ball up, and you gotta be the Pokeball Whisperer. You gotta be like, I believe. You gotta give it the ASMR treatment. You gotta be like, hey. <laughs> you, you, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta give it the ASMR treatment. You gotta be like, hey. Listen, I understand you're having a real rough time right now, but, but if you could just stay in that Pokeball and relax for just a few shakes, that'd be. That'd be real swell. That'd be fantastic. If you could just just calm down and relax and 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 just 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 enjoy life for a few moments. I'm I'm pretty sure that we could get along really well. So take this quick ball and shove it! I'm sorry, I have a, a bit of a problem there with my voice. Um, thank you, little bitch. gonna sound so bad in like the replay. Again, Hunter, great job on the crit, but was it really necessary? Was it really necessary? I mean, I guess. The audacity of this thing! The audacity of this thing! Okay, crit capture. I was gonna say, if you if you made me say the audacity of this thing one more time, I would have killed you. Thank you, though. Have a nice day. Bum bum bum. Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
It's an orb. progressively get worse and worse until eventually it shakes like 10 times and just like Now we've got we, we started at, at ankle deep and we went to knee deep and then we went to waist deep and now we're like up to here and once we hit 40 we'll be up to our necks in cricket tunes and then once it keeps going and we'll be up we'll be just covered in cricket tunes I got a whole string section at this point Anyway, we just passed 30, so the odds are increased once more of finding a shiny. Still no sign of any, though. Pity. But, uh... We're working the problem. We are working the problem. You know what? I trust. I trust that you made a mistake there. I'm just gonna throw a dust ball. You like this one better? This one looked nicer. This one more to your taste. Is the interior design looking better for you? Thank you. Well then, if you're gonna be a bitch about it. <laughs> Absorb rate. You took one HP and you healed one HP. <laughs> Just because of how rounding works. Now, will you accept this interior decorating? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. We can close the house on Monday, okay? And you'll be evicted by tomorrow night because I'm gonna I'm gonna release all of these Pokemon that I'm catching because they're not shiny and they're not special. I wasted all that time and the chain broke. I knew it was gonna happen eventually. Alright, good night everyone. Damn it. <laughs>